Hey everybody, what's up? I'm Dylan D, and this is the Ultima Gast Cannon. Already, you can see the sheer havoc this machine can wreak, so let's see what makes it tick. First up are all the ghast cages. I call it the hippo cage, obviously due to its appearance, with the sort of hippopotamus teeth in the front to keep the ghasts from escaping, but to also allow their projectiles to fire. Although, the top two cages are ghast missiles to add some flavor. I've actually done a tutorial for the ghast missile, and really hope everyone checks that out as well. Which you can see, the cages are about 75% of the overall design, so it wasn't too tricky of a build. Moving to the cockpit, I've put in dual long-reach TNT cannons that are easily accessible from the standing position in the cockpit, but more on the standing position in a moment. I got the TNT cannon design idea from Cube Hamster Innovation in Minecraft's TNT cannon atop his weaponized spider strider, although I was able to solve the moving redstone block. Now instead, two blocks just to the back of the machine move out and then back in. But the awesome thing about these blocks is that no matter what position they're in, when you start the machine again, the TNT cannons fix themselves on the fly. Moving on to the top of the Ultima Gast Cannon, developed by Alex Yu, is the Juggernaut 2.0. Modeled after Cube Hamster's Juggernaut, this missile is also easily fired from the cockpit. To fire the Gast missiles, you must come this direction through the back of the machine to the area where the trigger mechanism is waiting. Now this is a very advanced machine for a couple reasons already listed, but one more in particular. There is no boat in which to sit. You must stand and slightly move forward as the machine moves forward. You could easily hook up a pusher that would push a boat along, but what's the fun in the same cockpit idea over and over? And lastly, what everyone I'm sure has been asking the whole time while watching this, yes, you can pilot this monster in survival without any ghasts firing at you. Due to the glass placed just to the sides of me, they will try, but never actually fire off. And that is the Ultima Gast Cannon. Built on the PlayStation 3 as soon as Slime Blocks hit console, then I was finally able to get it onto PlayStation 4 for a showcase. I really hope you all enjoyed it, and if I get some positive feedback on this one, and if it's alright with the Missile Builder, I'd really enjoy doing a tutorial for this creation as well as my Rapticus. Just let me know. Until the next video though, you guys. Later late.